Hi guys, this is Hosein Abu, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get um, some of app unsupported applications for iOS 4.2.1. Um, a lot of guys were asking me to do such a video, so let's get to it. I'm going to show you that you got to be jailbroken, of course, because you already see that I'm on Cydia. So, uh, as you can see over here, focus, yeah. I point two comma one anyway iOS four point two point one there you got it um so first I'm gonna add a repo in order to install AppSync for iOS four point two point one so first tap on sources and we're gonna add this source cydia dot dot com double L so what you are going to do is go to edit and then go to add and type in cydia dot dot com yeah over here I don't know if I type type it in correctly. So anyway, tap add source. I already added it. So I'm gonna put it in a link in the description below. Put a link in the description below for it. I'm gonna write it in the description, yeah. So there is it. This one over here. Well after you add it, go to search. Load I can't believe I'm using iPod 2G 2015, so, <laughs> so old. Anyway, loading. <laughs> loading, 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 come on. Yep, yeah. absing. Search for AppSync. And it's loading again. Come on. Okay, we are going to scroll down. Well, I don't want you to install those. No. I didn't install those. Go to scroll down. Not these ones. Yeah, this one over here. App Sync for iOS 4.x and 6.x. Just tap it, and you're gonna, it's gonna show up a install button over here. Just gonna tap it and install, and I believe that it's gonna restart your. Uh, it's gonna respring, I think. So that's all. Uh, we're done with our iPod. Now, can I just click the home button? Yeah, we're done with our iPod. Now, I want you to go to this page. Um, yeah, iPhone box. I put. I will put a link in the description below. You can download it for Windows. You can download it for Mac. Download for Mac over here. I'm using Windows, so just download for Windows, and download the latest version, which is version two point. 94 new one just click on exe and your download will start um so gonna access iphone box and yeah connect your device i connected mine oh sorry uh before we get to iphone box 
I mean, uh, by the way, it's really easy to install. I will put also a link in the description below for this page for for shared. Um, this is my account, and these are some application I uploaded it. So I uploaded. It. Sorry for that. I got Zombieville and Monster Dash, Tiny Wings. I will upload more applications. You will find a lot. I have about uh, 27. Well, most of them are games, so let's, let's go for uh, Monster Dash. So, it's a for shared, so you have to log in. Let's click over here, download. And close that and download for free. And your download will start over here. But I'm gonna cancel that. So go to my account and yeah, I'm gonna go back to iPhone box. After you download the file, I want you to go to file file browser. Sorry for that. And then go to user application. I think I already have Doodle Jump as you see as you can see over here right click and install application so these are the applications so let's go to try on what we have over here let's say um let's say temple run yeah let's go temple run hit okay oh it's it failed i don't know why I won't upload that, so let's go try this one over here. What is it? Tetris, whatever. I'm gonna open it. And it is loading. Yeah, okay, this one says success. And the minimum iOS version requires is iOS 3.0. Just gonna install another one. To see if everything is okay. Because I don't know why I had that failed message. Let's go to Opera Mini. I'm gonna just find it real quick over here. I hope nothing will go wrong. Yeah. It says success. Minimum iOS version requires is iOS 4.2. So I have a lot of others. Uh, I have Crash, Asphalt 6, Angry Birds, Cut the Rope, Doodle Jump, Google Earth, Flick Soccer, Jetpack Joyride, I Stunt, Messenger for Facebook, and some Need for Speed. Temple Run, I want to plug that because it didn't work. Tiny Wings, Icon Pro, Monster Dash, Need for Speed, Need for Speed, Zombieville. So we're gonna you're gonna find them all in in the link in the description below. So I'm gonna show you that I have them over here. So it's gonna focus. Come on. So let's say so this building game. Yeah, okay. Sorry, so I don't know why my camera is not focusing. Come on, please focus. Anyway, let's go to Marathon. So, well, I'm not gonna play, so I mean, you get the idea that everything is functioning. Blah 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 blah. Let's go doodle jump. Shut up. Doodle jump. Well, it's a full version, of course. It is loading. And can change the themes over here. Let's go to play. Yeah, so. That's it. Um, so you get it that just do the same thing that I just did 
for installing Opera Mini and this building game Tetris or whatever Tetris. Well, I don't know how to pronounce it. Whatever. So that's all for how to get some of unsupported applications on your on iOS 4.2.1. So don't forget to rate this video, comment, like it. It's still running on iOS 4.2.1 on 2014. Um, don't forget to check my channel for other videos I have for some of Android and and for iOS 4.2.1, you know, Facebook, Twitter, and everything. So, uh, thanks for watching, and see you in the next one. Bye.